So earlier today, um, I was at my boy Quincy's uh, son's birthday party, uh, Kendrick, and um, we all got the news about um, Kobe Bryant passing. And one of the main things that I was, I was thinking, and I said to my son, I said, I hope none of his children were with him. And to beginning, to begin with, we thought none of his kids were with him. Um, but then later on, come to find out, his 13 year old daughter, Gigi, was with him. So, um, I haven't never gone on on video or social media to really talk about um, what I went through with my wife a couple of months back. Um, she lost her son who was, he was 20 years old and um, I know a lot of people are putting up signs and posting stuff about Kobe and his daughter but um, my thoughts and prayers go out to his family because I can still hear the screams that my fiance made when she heard that she lost her son her baby and um I'm taken back to that moment and I can only imagine how his wife and his oldest daughter are reacting what they're feeling what they're going through now I wouldn't wish that on anyone. Just thinking back now, it's still hard. Um, you sort of move on because you have to, because life goes on, but you, you, it's never the same. Um, Maria struggles with it a lot still. Some days are good, most days aren't. Um, we actually started doing this YouTube page as a, a way to give her an outlet, sort of speak, to just do something to keep her mind off of everything else. But it's been rough because lost them in July and um, actually June 30th, lost them. Birthday was December 9th, then the holidays. So it's just been rough. And I can only imagine the road and recovery that Miss Bryant and her oldest daughter have coming. And then he's leaving a seven month old who's not going to who her father was. I mean, of course, you'll hear from everybody else. And most of them will be always a great basketball player, but as a man, as a as a husband, as a son, she won't know her father the way others have. So I just wanted to post this just to say my heart goes out to the Bryant family, his wife, his daughters, those closest to him because going through what I went through with my wife, you can Say in your mind, oh, well, if this happened to me, I couldn't imagine. Or you could tell somebody, you know, condolences. But until you've experienced, until you've went through it, you don't really know what that feeling is and how it changes you forever. And you'll never be the same. Um, it's easy for people over time to be like, oh, it's time to move on and all this stuff. But for those of us who've dealt with it, who's gone through it, we know it could be... 10, 15 years from now and you'll still not be over it. So my heart goes out to the Bryant family and um, rest in heaven, Kobe and Gigi and um, everybody out there just love each other, take care of each other, cherish every moment you have with each other because you never know when that day will come it can come at any time, anywhere. So tell people you love them now. Don't wait until they're gone to show them how much they're loved.
do it now. So I'll leave it at that and one love. <laughs>